Okay, so I wanted to talk engine quench here while I got the, while I'm getting ready to put the heads on this budget small block. Um, but what quench is, is the distance between the flat top part of your piston and your cylinder head. And um, the, di the gasket thickness distance also factors into that. But what you're after is 35 to 45 thousandths. Now see from the factory, these pistons that I re-ringed, um, they almost come out of the board just a little bit. So they're almost above the deck. So that's really what you want. And then you can go by your gaskets to get the correct um, thickness for quench. The, uh, the idea behind quench is that you get more of a complete combustion and it really helps to prevent detonation. So quench is very important to have that 35 to 45 thousandths. Um, now where the problem comes in with rebuilds in this quench area is rebuilt or um, pistons that most pistons that are sold are not the same as these height as these factory pistons because they're sold to a mostly mass engine building places and what they get is a lot of just bare stock blocks and the decks are all dinged up so they got to deck the uh, they got to deck it down and when this head surface is decked down then they're in the proper um, then they'll get proper quench out of that. But for most people at home, and when they don't deck their block, you'll see that the piston actually will sit into the combustion chamber a little bit. So that's really a problem. So if you're rebuilding a motor, you really want to look into this and get your block decked because that 35 to 40 thousandths quench is really, really nice to have. It makes a huge difference. When I The first few motors that I did, I wasn't aware of this and I really had to run some retarded timing and really dumb down the tune just for the, just because I'd get pinging from not having these set right. So with this quench you can run 10 to 1 with iron heads on pump gas without much of a problem but it's really important. Now these pistons here, it's only the flat top part of your piston so these valve reliefs don't factor into the quench and this uh, um, dished part does not factor into the quench. It's only the flat top part. So if you can help it, you want to run flat top pistons because they're a really big performance advantage for quench reasons. But flat top pistons and all that boosting compression gets hazardous to uh, your engine performance when you don't have your block um, and piston clearance decked correctly. So. Um, get a side look here so you can see that that piston is just ever so slightly even coming out of the bore so it'll be just about perfect and um, we'll basically go by our gasket um, compressed thickness and then that'll be our quench so with a stock camshaft we should be good we shouldn't be having to worry about clearance issues especially with these valve reliefs here so um, pretty much we're good to go but that's something to think about when you're build, building your motor and especially when you put aftermarket pistons in is you really want to watch this because this can really vary so anyway so that's engine quench for you something to be aware of